The only things we know about those lost years uh, are in 1585, he was in Stratford, in 1592, he was in London. What happened? How did he get from A to B? Well, people said that uh, in those years, Shakespeare did many things. He was, was just a, an apprentice to his father in his business as a glover. Others say that he went north to Lancashire because he might have been, and this is a, a reasonable supposition, he might have been a Roman Catholic. And to be a Roman Catholic in Elizabethan times is very dangerous. Some say that he became uh, a hooligan and drinker around Bidford, with the Bedf Bidford Sippers, they were called. He used to go drinking with them, it was said. And uh, in the company of a couple of hooligans, townies from Stratford, he went up to the Lucy estate at Chalcot Manor, just above Stratford there, and poached deer. And for which exercise he was whipped and fined by Lucy, the owner and uh, got his revenge by writing uh, a part <laughs> in which he lampooned uh, Lucy as a ridiculous magistrate or whatever. The only trouble with that one, of course, is that there was no deer park at Charlcott at the time, so he couldn't have nicked any deer, we don't think. Others say John Aubrey, for example, the, the great <laughs> gossip uh, from Stratford, I think, Stratford man himself, um, said that he was a, became a teacher in the country. That means he taught it anywhere but London. Uh, well, if he did that, he was remarkably unqualified to do so because he left school at 15. And most teachers uh, had to go to university in order to qualify as teachers. You know? So that seems unlikely. But there is another theory, which is the one I like because it's so Elizabethan. And the story is this, that the Queen's company, one of the great companies, because they belonged to the Queen, was on tour. And when this great company got to tame, they suffered a setback because one of their number, one of their lead actors, a guy called Nell, William Nell, got into a brawl one night outside the White Hound Inn, which I believe might be still there in Tame, and he was stabbed to death, this actor, by a man called Mr. Town, uh, through the neck. And so the company was one man short, uh, but they progressed on to Stratford, where they were treated right royally by the local council, earned a lot of money. And it's thought that at this point that Shakespeare was taken on board to replace the William Nell who'd been murdered in Tame. And the company took him with him, with, it, with them on the rest of the tour and uh, then back to London. And this is the reason he appears in 1592, some five years later. What do we really know about the world's greatest playwright? 1564, William Shakespeare was born. The plague hit Stratford. A huge number of people are dying.